Okay. Buckerson and Myers. Um, episode uh, episode uh, six. Episode six. 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 Episode six. Are we six right. episodes in? This is it, be. man. This Are, is, is this almost the end? No. I mean, not the, at the pace you guys go at. We've got at least 12 episodes left. What? Uh, what? <laughs> Timmy, there's a big change this time, right? To to how we're playing the game. Because I moved my camera. No, because <laughs> the homework you gave Trevor and Darren. Yes. Okay. Right. So our whole approach has been no one gives a shit. But there's some <laughs> stuff that I wanted to maybe give a little bit of a shit. So I. Said, I don't like this. I don't like this. I know you don't like. I know. I I. I Trust me, I know you guys don't like giving a shit about this. But hey, I'm going to level with you, Timmy. I'm still not giving a shit. <laughs> oh, I know. That's the, that's the, okay, the homework I sent was to Trevor and Darren to help make the scenes where they want to do magic a little easier. Literally, Trevor, did you do, look at the email that he sent you? I did. No, they did. Oh, did. So here's, let, let me get to it, man. So all, literally the assignment was they each had to pick eight words. Yeah, I don't really know what you sent or what you're asking. No, dude, I neither just do I. sent so words I just, back to you. That's what, well, that was the goal because we don't want to know too much about this, right? So I just sent you the names of the spells. Most of them, I don't know what they are either. No, I, I looked at it and I looked them up and I, I, I chose mine. Um, I, I got a whole fucking plan. How come, <laughs> how come Peppermint <laughs> is magic? She's just a big orc. I like I the one. She's a cleric, man. Yeah. yeah. Read a fucking book. I have, I have saved your life. She's you, like you the, have dude, been at death's magic. door, and I yeah. Didn't you use life. magic to heal him? No, dude. Yeah. Someone drew the hottest picture of peppermint that just came in a couple hours ago. Really? Oh yeah. shit! Oh shit! Is that why you were late? <laughs> 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 so, all right. So we're all in the cart. You're all in the cart. Who do we got? Who's who's uh, besides you? Who's with you? Just Pip, right? Pip's alive. Just Pip. So. Elmer had an unfortunate accident. Right, where he fell right on the tip of Trevor's knife as it was held out towards yeah, him. Yeah, Elmer passed away. So he's gone. Okay. I, I miss was wondering him. about that. I do miss him a lot. So I forget what we're doing, though. So we ran away from a bunch of guys. We got on a cart, and now we're just getting out of Strip Club City, right? Okay, so at one point, the idea was to try and find this mine, and that's fine. That might still happen. I know that, so an episode or two ago, the idea was to try and find where all the cocaine is coming from and like kind of, you know, muscle in on it, right? Is that kind of what we were thinking? Yes. Yeah. Okay. So as we're riding, I turn on the radio and I look back at the guys and I'm like, do you guys like uh, Santana and Rob Thomas? And it goes, oh, it's a hot one. <laughs> and I'm like playing that and we're all like vibing. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> this wait. is no, really no. good. We yeah. gotta rob. We gotta run. We gotta roll charisma for the Rob Thomas song. We gotta see how well everybody. We gotta see how well the Rob Thomas song plays. I it's think gonna you're gonna great. roll a twenty. It's gonna do great. <laughs> okay, here we go. We got a fourteen. I'll give yeah, a we like 20. it. We <laughs> definitely <laughs> like it. And plus, like Rob it. Thomas and Santana have a plus five in charisma. Hey, <laughs> they do. I just <laughs> give them a plus like one. The ocean but... Under the moon. <laughs> Dude, no, no. Oh man, that song. Jesus. <laughs> Forget okay. about Listen it. Listen to the radio. <laughs> Might as well forget about it. <laughs> the guitar solo goes on forever. That's smooth, right? It goes yeah, smooth. Yeah, smooth. I Here, I'd like you to roll to see if Pip is vibing to the song. Yes. Okay. Let's see how. Let's see how Pip does. Okay. So the song only gets an eleven on Pip. This kid. He's is, his name should be hey, fucking Trevor. Mike. Or Fut. Fut. I think your son is depressed. I think you should give him a pep talk. <laughs> hey. Kid, life short, reaction man. to everything is just like life Dude, short. Give man. him some, give him some blow. <laughs> no, no, no. He's too young. I'm not. All right, him I'm saying the music will sound a lot better if he is, you know, on the train. Sh- yeah, or or you could do a magic spell on him and right? and force him to dance. Oh, I I do a magic on him that makes him love Rob Thomas. All right, let's get to the spell book because you had something like that, didn't you? You had charm person. Oh, yeah. So I'd say to everybody, oh, by the way, by the by, exciting news, everyone. Um, I just got an email uh, that has a list of spells that I can do um, that my friend sent me. So now I can do spells because I have an email. 
You got a 12 plus 13. So yeah, so he starts, uh, you know, everything with his kids shoots down the middle. I don't know what the fucking karma is there. There we <laughs> go. Your little robot kid's coming around. All right. Oh, oh it's a hot one. He starts rubbing his fingers together like he wants to snap, you know? So he's like. Hey, fuck, your son reminds me a lot of Haley Joel Osment in that uh, AI movie. That's, uh, that's yeah. who we've got on our hands here. Yeah, but <laughs> don't worry. After hanging out with us for a while, he's going to be cool as shit. He's going to. Uh, in, in He'll be like Jonathan Taylor Thomas and Pinocchio when we're done with him. <laughs> he's going to be like fucking Rob Thomas. That's what he's going to be. Oh, my. Dude. <laughs> He'll be one of the Thomases. Okay. Yeah. And now Santana's guitar solo comes up in the song, and that rolled a 16 plus five. So that's a 21. So now you guys are really fucking into the song. Like, you know, at the end where he just fucking gets into it, you guys are really rolling on it. So. It's I good. put the CD on loop, so this is all we're going to listen to the whole ride. <laughs> but, okay, so you're going down the road, and uh, there's, a, there's a couple guys uh, kind of sprawling on the road. They're alive. Uh, they've got, like, pickaxes and mining gear with them, and their faces are covered in white dust, and they're kind of lying on the road. Their faces are covered in white dust? Yes, and they're, like, totally out of it. Uh, I'm going to ask you to turn the music down momentarily, my friend. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I will be asking you to blast it as soon as this is over, but we got to figure out what's going on with these two party animals right here. Motion I, seconded by anyone? Can, yeah. Can I lick my finger, rub it across one of their faces, and then rub it on my gums? I'm going to insist that you do that. <laughs> Get over yeah. there, Bobo. <laughs> okay, so let's do a dexterity check for Bobo. <laughs> to see if he can lick his finger? Yeah, absolutely. He misses man. and stabs his eye out. <laughs> <laughs> How do you fuck up licking your finger? 150,000 views. Sam pulls his actually poke. Okay, anyways, uh, okay. So we got a, yeah, you did all right on that. You got like an 11, so you get Yeah, it. you lick your finger, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you get it and you, you put it in your mouth and uh, yeah, it definitely gives you a kick. Ooh. Okay. What do we got? Oh. Verdict is? Yeah, Bobo? cocaine. <laughs> I, okay, I lick my finger, I run it across the guy's face, and then I put my finger up my ass, and then like a cop, I turn and go, that's the stuff. <laughs> Wait, should we do dexterity check for putting his finger in his ass? Through his nah, I just do it. Uh, you got a six, but okay, I'll let you go. Okay, no, you miss your ass. You stab you yourself in the balls. Totally. <laughs> he like cut his ass, ass, but it's too tight. You can't get it in. Oh, yeah. No, that's what happens. You get your finger in your ass, but you can't get it out. Okay, I use a magic spell to make my ass more loose. I don't see. I didn't, that wasn't on the list. That's and that's also, I, it's not your turn anymore. Yeah. Right now, your finger is stuck yeah, in your you asshole. you got your hands like, stuck in between, betwixt your buttocks. And I'm like, uh, I'm on the cart watching this. I'm like, hey, Fut, what's going on with your hand there, bud? Checking the, this cocaine. Okay, but why is your hand still in your butthole there, bud? It got stuck. <laughs> I grab Fut's hand and I help him pull his hand. Yeah, all right. Strength, we'll do a strength check. I don't really think all, it's all true. three of us do it at the same time. Oh, like there you go. God, I have the best friends. <laughs> okay, I, I'm staying on the cart. All right, all right. Bobo and I you guys, do it. You guys successfully jam as you Bobo and Peppermint grab his hand and I high it. five everyone yeah. with the other hand. Yeah, <laughs> okay. Um, so okay. I'm going to go check out and see if these guys are alive, because if they are, I want to know what's going on with them. So I go up and I, I kick one of the dudes in the, in the leg. I'm like, hello? Hello? <laughs> I want to know what's going on with these guys. So I'm going to kick them in the face. <laughs> I said <laughs> leg. leg. All right. Cool. The leg. Yeah. I just think it's funny that you didn't talk to them. That's okay. So, um, I'm seeing if he's alive. All right. So, all right. You only got a three, so you you kick some dirt onto him, and he kind of struggles a little bit. So they're like there, they're you know they're yeah, shaking. he's alive. They're alive. Uh, sup, 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 party dudes. Where are you coming from? Oh, the well. He's he's got it everywhere. You have to you have to stop him. The well. The the well. Are we looking for a person named the well? <laughs> it's a well. Oh, it's a whale. Oh, a whale. It's a whale. It's a whale. It's a whale. Like, a whale. like the well. Uh, like, sir, the whale. are you saying a whale or a well? Uh, and one, the one guy dies. And, uh, <laughs> well, yeah, we're looking uh, for a whale or a there's well. There's a fucking coke whale out there that has <laughs> murdered these men. There, All right, is his friend a, alive? I kick his friend hard in the knee. Okay. Hey, let's see. wake up. Hard in the what? Knee. Knee? Okay, yeah. You get, oh, oh, it's old owl. 
well. I still don't know, honestly, if he's yeah, going well or well. He goes well. 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 Oh, well. well. We should like call a, this whale Free Base Willie. It's a hole with water in it. Oh. Yeah, like a like a like a, uh, like a okay. blowhole. Blowhole, like a blowhole. Did yeah. this guy die? Yeah. So he's like, well, yeah. He he's passed out. He's you know, they're both okay. clearly you know. All right, Peppermint. Like, do you can you heal this guy? Can you wake him up and heal him? Well, I can. I was gonna investigate them though. I there was gonna go. like look through all their clothes. <laughs> um. Okay. So you you check their pockets. And, uh, you know, they they have mining gear and, you know, they have, one of them has one little sack with just a little bit, a little dust of, of white stuff in it, in the bottom. And, I eat it. And there's inside that uh, bag is a little piece of white paper with a, with a black spider on it. Um, you ate it? It's gone. <laughs> it's <laughs> That's in not even how stomach. you do coke, man. Ate the cocaine. Yeah. Well, right. I'm an orc, so. Yeah. You know, I'm like peppermint. I'm different. Next time you get no, cocaine, you're supposed to shove it up your ass. <laughs> <laughs> Anywhere where the membranes thin. Yeah, not stomach acid. Yeah. Sorry, guys. I, okay. I feel it. I think I feel it. No, you don't. Okay. It's so the cocaine rolled a ten on. You, the cocaine, uh, uh, you don't. You don't feel it. The cocaine rolled a ten on Peppermint's stomach, so she is starting to kind of feel a little gurgle. You know, a little rush, a little bit. Oh, uh, you're gonna have to take the coke shits now. <laughs> <laughs> and have the coke runs so when these guys had you know a, a couple of silver pieces not much money left they had some pickaxes and stuff that have clearly been well used and uh yeah they're clearly coked out of their minds and dead and or dying I so to, we, cut, we, we cut these guys heads off and keep going like <laughs> to like bring their coke covered faces with us no just i don't know <laughs> just to kill them oh <laughs> See, I, I'm getting worried about. I can't say anything. I'm, I'm just the omnipotent storyteller. I'm a little worried about Fut's social tendencies uh, uh, deteriorating. I'm, I'm going to snort some more off their faces. <laughs> I'm going to snort some more off their faces too. Okay, this is cool. What we're doing. All right. Oh, Sam rolled a natural twenty for snorting, so he gets a real good fucking line oh, right nice. off the guys. Right off. He he end, he goes up his chin and like right over the nose and up the forehead. He fucking nails I it. Snort off his lips. That's yeah, dude, you don't care. It's he's gonna be class. so Everybody's fucking talkative now. Fucking flag. And uh, uh, hyphen, you got a fifteen, so you get a real good key. You know, good. Tootin, rootin, tootin. <laughs> okay, what was the part about there's I'm a like, piece of paper so, with what's a this? black? Cut off heads. We're cutting heads off. Is that what we're doing? <laughs> Hold on. Peppermint asked a question that might actually be about the story. Uh, so okay. <laughs> there's a. Well, okay, go ahead. Well. Throughout this, you guys might remember there's been little hints of uh, something or someone called the Black Spider that's like in control of the drugs. They're right. Glass Staff's boss. They're, the Black Spider has been printed on some of the crates and things like that that have been seen up at the, you know, coming into town. So, Okay. Um, can I investigate the environment around me? Did they come from a mine? Or like, uh, do they have any carts or horses nearby? Yeah, so, uh, you get an eleven for that, so you, you get a you have a kind of a decent look. You can tell that they came from further down the road over a hill. Are we gonna leave these bodies here? We're we gonna do anything cool with these bodies? Or one of them's still alive, right? He's like passed out. I mean, he's like you know, he's on his way out the door. He's dying. dying. Yeah, he's like I'll he's stop, like I'll I mean, he's so poked face. out that he's like basically his body's shutting down. I'm sorry. Let's go see, ahead. Let's just, let's just leave him. Let's just leave. I I go back to the cart and I blast Santana. Well, yeah, we all turn to we all turn to the cart and we walk back. But as we're turning, I stomp his face and then Correct. just walk towards the cart. And you got a twelve on that, so you broke you broke the dying man's face. So, so that, 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 that that's another kill on my uh, on your belt. Uh, who's killed the most people? It's probably you know I should be notching it. Peppermint or Bobo? Well, Peppermint threw a spear through three people, that's and then. True. Cleave that barbarian's face off. Yeah, yeah but you killed a I'm couple probably guys winning. pretty quickly in the first one, uh, hyphen Potter News. Yeah. Yeah. I, I killed like three. I killed goblins? a bunch of uh, uh, goblins. Yeah, they both killed a bunch. And Trevor's Sam, you killed... murdered uh, Sildar in cold blood. Yeah. Who did? Sam did. Sam did. Bobo did. I okay. killed Sildar? You dealt the final blow. Yeah. But yeah. Then, uh, it was fucked up. Uh, I haven't uh, killed that many because my dude's a pacifist. I right. think if you 
killed the most innocents. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Wait, who killed are... the kid's dad? There was that whole bar fight. Who killed all those? Oh, well, that I mean, the kids, the whole dad thing. That was for a, a greater good. That was for a, a bigger cause. So. I think it's I might have killed the dad with I didn't my. Even know the kid arrow. existed yet when you killed the dad. Oh, what about the mom? That was that, that was that for a bigger purpose thing. That was okay. Fudd's whole. Yeah, that was. That was to save a kid from a shitty situation. That you created by murdering his. And what about oh, what about? Now? Gordon or whatever his name is, the kid's original caretaker. That was oh, to get guy, out of a Elmer. problem. That I, was killed Elmer. Him. I killed him yeah. because because Darren went crazy and chopped a lady's face off, and they were all barbarians, and they were going to kill us. So to like calm everyone down, I killed Elmer. Right. Okay. Okay. So uh, as the cart's going down towards the hill, you have um, you get approached by uh, by four hobgoblins, which mm. are like bigger goblins. Okay. And so they, they are, you know, and th that's just like, we're talking just straight up murder beasts. There's no talking to them. They're, they're okay, just but like crazy I monster. think, you know, uh, uh, we knew that at some point or another, Pip was going to have to become a man, you know, uh -huh. in combat. I would say, let's, uh, he can take my, my little dagger here. Let's, let's let him strike the first blow. No. No. No? No, I got to protect. As a matter of fact, one of my magics that the email gate that, that I got an email about uh, says that I can, uh, it, it's something like armor, that I can put armor on people. Right? Yes. Oh, uh, what about Perfect. mage armor? Yeah. yeah. So I put, I mean, what that wizard guy had before he killed himself. I put mage armor on Pip to keep him safe. Dude, Why don't you and, put mage armor and, on him and then go, have him go attack them? Though? That's what I'm saying. If we, because, you mage, look, just hear me out, hear me out. You mage the kid so he's basically invincible. We give him a little thing. He goes running at one of them, and then from behind, we will, you know, I'll shoot an arrow. We'll all, we'll make, we'll give him a confidence boost. This kid's fucked up, man. He Can needs I a win, something? dude. Give him a win. What peppermint? Yeah. And yep. I have a spell called spiritual weapon, where I can summon a holy weapon, and I can make it whatever I want, and it could go into battle with uh, Pip and fight all these guys and help and yeah. help them out. Pip's not going it, into it, battle. <laughs> He's protected. We're all here watching. He's going to be fine. Okay. You're like the one of those overprotective parents. You're like a you're a Karen mom. He's, right a, he's, he's, a, hel he's yeah. a helicopter wizard. I'm a helicopter wizard, but he's he's too young to be fighting. Should we should we roll out this argument? Yeah. Okay. All right. So uh, let's go with. Uh, okay. Fought, making his case that he doesn't want his adopted son to be to get some good spells as protection but then have to then go rush into battle okay so he's trying to convince you guys that that's not a good idea right? i was first trying to convince him i don't know why he's rolling first yeah okay let's roll zach first okay fine all right but i mean okay it's a charisma uh, yeah his charisma is so good okay i want to see this. all right so you got an 18 zach got an 18 and trevor uh, let's see here well you got a six buddy so, uh, so, Pip, buckle up, buddy. <laughs> Little Pippy's going to war. All right. Now, okay, I, no. I think we should all do our damnedest to make sure this kid is victorious, right? Yes. Yeah. He's a part right. of the team. I, we got I, what? We got four hobgoblins. You guys can. You got. You, you guys got. It. All right, we got it. All right. So I, I look at everybody and I say, "All right, like because you've convinced me a little bit, I'll send him in." But I swear to God, if anything happens to him. I will turn every magic I have against each of you, and I will fight until I or all of you are dead. What What could possibly go wrong? What could happen? Know. That's That's what I tell everyone. <laughs> and I got whole, be fine. I got a whole fucking email here full of magic. Yeah, he's <laughs> gonna put us in an arm bar and give you some yeah. umbros. Oh know, God man. forbid, I get umbros. I'm loaded to the gills now. Yeah, I turn to Scott and I say, "Hey, up. thanks for the heads up." <laughs> <laughs> she goes down. Bring yeah. it on. Yeah. Yeah. So, so now you guys know that if Pip falls to immediately all turn on foot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you better hope Pip's all right. We're going to be got, stomped to death yeah. by three Umbros wearing motherfuckers. Go ahead. If, people don't, if Pip dies, I don't have anything to live for anymore. So, like, I don't even give a shit. He's I'm not going to die. Hard. He's oh, not my die. God. <laughs> He's not He's even not that great. Okay, let's go to let's go to the spells and then get into the, the hubbub here. So uh, we'll right. go to I'm gonna go for, uh, around on my screen. 
Uh, so Peppermint, go ahead and, and you, you're, so you're going to cast your spiritual uh, weapon, right? So it's yeah, a spiritual weapon, spiritual and weapon. I'll turn it, I'll turn it into a mace. There you go. A mace, that's one with a ball and chain on the stick, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and it can cool. just, it can fly like helicopter through right, the air cool. and attack each of the hobgoblins along with Pip. I think he's doing all right. All right, uh, so then Hyphen, what are you going to do? I'm going to basically, the moment Pip attacks the first hobgoblin, I'm going to arrow that dude. Okay. So You're going to arrow Pip? No. I mean, I, I, I'm rooting for Pip. This he kid needs some self-esteem. He thinks Pip needs, uh, needs to get the, uh, I, I get what you're saying. You, you, you need to think his battery needs a jolt, right? We got to get a win. This, this middle distance that he's kind of sunken into. We got to get the adrenaline flowing, right? I mean, if this kid yeah, dies, I mean, episode seven is either the three guys without me or me without the three guys. It's, uh, <laughs> it's going fucking down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> This kid's not oh, gonna die. It'll I'm be the sure, three guys. I'm sure that if uh, if Fun way. happens to murder all of his friends this episode, I'm sure in his next journey he'll meet he'll meet some three swarthy uh, <laughs> badasses that want to team up with a murderous psychopath. <laughs> all right, so let's have a you know what? <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of new fan art. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the drawing board, everybody. I, I like how just a couple of minutes ago we were like, this is going to go on for 12 more episodes. No, it ain't. It's fucking ending right here. <laughs> it's also uh, so, funny that we're doing this. We just got t shirts made, man. Yeah, I could have murdered the whole team. Right. Can I give Pip a pep talk before he goes out there? Yeah, okay. So he's like ready to go. He's like, I'm like, look, little dude, you got this. Hobgoblins are bitches. You're a little, you're a little tiger, okay? I want you to be a little tiger. And just get out there, use your claws, use your weapons, and like go shred these motherfuckers, okay? Right. Avenge your parents. Let's see how this Go done. get some. Go Avenge get some your blood. parents. All right, that got a twenty, man. It really did. So yeah, he's fired team. up. So Pip's like, yeah, like, I'm, ah! I'm a Can I talk to Pip? tiger, right? So he like no, jumps no. over. No, you'll ruin you wanna, it. I just jazzed him, dude. You're gonna, you're gonna it's fucking not, stress I, him out. Son, I'm sending the battle. I'm gonna give him. A, I'm gonna say something to him. You're gonna stress him out. Watch. It's gonna go wrong. It's no, gonna go bad. wrong. I go down to Pip and I'm like, "Do good out there. Uh, do me proud. I, I love you more than life itself. And uh, just know uh, that if you fall, I will avenge you." Why uh, would you put that into his head? And and. <laughs> And if you do fall, I will be right behind you in Valhalla. <laughs> okay, let's see how okay. that goes. I had him feeling invincible, and you're like, if you die, which you probably will. What? what? Are you rolling? Pip, Pip is it's, rolling his eyes right now. He got a 12. So, like, it's always right in the middle with fun, Pip. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's like, so Pip's like all jazz from hyphen speech. Like, yeah, that's right. And then Trevor says that stuff. He's like, okay, cool. Thanks, Dad. You know, just. Oh. <laughs> okay, great. He just right. jumps over the cart. So now Pip? he. I he love runs you. up to the first uh, hobgoblin. Pip, I love you. Roll first, I love you. Pip, I love you. Ooh, that was an 18. So he like gets out of the cart. He's about to swing his sword. And he goes, I love you too, dad. So let's oh. see how well he does. Because he's still kind of riding high off of my pep talk. Right, yeah, because of all I'll that hyphen it. energy. <laughs> okay. he's, he, he runs across the field, right? He uh, gets his sword out. He goes, I love you too, dad. And then he swings at the first hobgoblin, right? And he gets a 19. And so it's probably gonna, I mean, it's gonna fuck this guy up. So let's see here. Wait. Oh yeah. What? Does he say anything like a, a, a catchphrase thing? He says, yeah, I love you too, dad, as he swings his sword. That's not a good, we gotta, we gotta work on catchphrases with this. As he's running, he goes, I love my dad. And he jumps. <laughs> this is a dork, dude. Okay. He's a fucking dork. <laughs> I mean, hey, given where he uh, was a few minutes ago, I mean, we got to admit this is a pretty big improvement, you know? Yeah, this so is a anyways, he does, uh, he does nine hits of damage to this guy. So the first hobgoblin's almost dead already. It's only got two. And, and I loose an arrow at the same goblin at the same yeah. time. All right, cool. Love it. So let's do that. Ooh, I don't know if you're going to hit him. You gotta if I get a one, him. I hit Pip. You got a seven. No, you got a seven. So that's a 10. You do not hit him. You just barely miss him because these guys have a high armor class. They're so I miss him, and then I, I look at I look at Fut, and I'm like, I, I, I'll take another shot in a second. It's I, gonna be fine. All right, I, well, throw, I start charging my magic missile. I, and looking at that. Yeah, yeah. No, I like that. You're yeah, aim, it at the, oh. aim it at the fucking monsters. I throw my spear at the guy that Zach missed. Okay, cool. My javelin. Jesus, man, that that missed too. Uh -oh. All right. 
Pip might be in a little bit of trouble coming. All right, we better yeah, give the hobgoblins yeah, a turn before we get back to you guys. So, uh, wait, I haven't even gone yet. Goblin, what are these? Yeah, guys you do? haven't gone he, yet. He, no, no, he might, did. You guys both cast magic. Cast oh, magic. Oh, 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 oh. So now we're gonna give some hobgoblins a shot and get back to you guys. So Ooh, the first okay. hobgoblin. Um, <laughs> oh, wait, how much for attack, Pip? It's gonna be really bad. How much energy? Not. How much energy does Pip have? So Pip only has about. 11 hit points but he has pretty high armor so you know we'll see how he does so the first uh hobgoblin swings his um his long sword at pip and misses him okay that's what's up so the first the second one also misses him hell um, yes wait can i join pip in battle because i don't really have anything that i can throw at them from across the battlefield i mean right? I, I think I you mean, do have one thing you could throw peppermint <laughs> Ah, uh -huh. well, what is uh, like isn't is isn't my spiritual weapon? Isn't that? Oh yeah, your spiritual weapon. Let's do that. So so that's I guess we'll have that. That's kind of its own thing, but we'll have it take its actions on your turn. So um, it should take a hit point or something like that on each hobgoblin. I gotta say, I'm I am legit stressed for this little kid right now. <laughs> we get the guy that's already down. You want me to aim at that guy? Yeah, take mate? him out of the equation so he doesn't get another with shot. Your magic weapon. Okay, so we'll swing at him. So, but that, that killed the one that was almost dead. So, yeah, so now there's cool. only one. That was the one that first took its swing at, at Pip. So then there's another one near him, and then there's two more. So go ahead. And then, okay, so then I'll use uh, my command spell. Can I do that? Yeah, go On for it. one of the other hobgoblins, and I'll command one of the hobgoblins to approach and come to us. To come to you. Okay. Yeah. Oh, man, you really did your homework. You looked this shit up and everything. All right, cool. Yeah, yeah, I did. Why don't you command him to attack one of the other hobgoblins? I can't do that. Oh. Cool. Oh, yeah, you got a natural 20. So, like, you really did. So he, he walks through. So he just suddenly, the second hobgoblin, the, the other one that swung at Pip that hasn't been hurt yet, just suddenly goes like this and just starts kind of zombie walking uh, up to your cart. And we're like, good job, Pip. Yeah, Pip. <laughs> <laughs> you scared him. Way to follow through, bud. Way to follow through. <laughs> So we're almost a foot. We're I'm going to give it one hobgoblin a move in between Peppermint and Foot. So the Timmy, third what? hobgoblin takes a shot at uh, Hyphen because he was shooting at them. So uh, the third hobgoblin takes a shot. Uh oh, only three. So you're down to the 17 hit points. You're still fine. I'm like, so. ow, fucker, ow. <laughs> All right, Foot, it's your big move, buddy. All right, I, I look at my email. <laughs> Hold on, I'm I, I'm literally looking at my email to see. I got what. it. What are you looking for? We got uh, okay. Oh, okay, I got it. So what I do is um, I, I do a charm person on. There's only one guy left with Pip, right? No, there's um, there's two. there's two. There's a dead guy and two more with Pip. The other one has walked up to the cart. Okay, so I, I can I do charm on both of those dudes that are next to Pip? Oh yes, you can charm two. Okay, so I charm the two of them. Okay, so we're gonna do a wisdom saving throw. Let's see. That's we gotta smart. make sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. You got a fourteen. So you charmed both of them. <clears throat> so, basically, the charmed charmed creatures regard you, regard you as friendly. So that basically means they're not going to attack you. Uh, me or Pip? Um. Well, we could say we get, you want to have them charm towards Pip. We can make that part of your. Yeah, I want them to be friends with Pip. So now they're now they're both like. So the other two uh, hobgoblins that are near near Pip suddenly kind of go like this and start uh you know they lower their weapons and they they say to pip like how you doing man what's up great all Come right on, so so there's one hobgoblin left uh taking a turn we'll go between trevor and zach here and uh that hobgoblin now that he's kind of been struck as as and he he's looking upon this boy as friendly he asks pip uh pointing at the car like are those guys messing with you pointing at us yeah asking pip if, if you guys are like messing with him Okay. So what, what does Pip say? Well, Pip should take a shot at this guy, right? I go, cut his fucking throat out, Pip. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see that. Oh, that, we'll yeah, cut so, yours. So he hears you, you. You got like a 14 on that. So he's like, okay, so Pip's going to, well, it's not Pip's. Is, yeah, it is Pip's turn. Okay, yeah, yeah. So it's Pip's turn now. So he's going to swing his sword. Oh, yeah, he got a 15 and he gets, uh, My he's boy. He gets some good swings here. You know, so Pip swings at him and just slashes the guy across the chest. After he was asking this kid if he was okay. <laughs> and then I, it's my uh -huh. go, right? I try yeah, and hit the guy it. with yeah. another arrow. 
Okay. You shoot at that guy? Yeah, because I want that guy dead. I want Pip to think he, he killed him. Oh, I get it. I get it. All right, cool. So, oh, dude, you got a natural 20. Good job. So, um, it goes. You're really rolling well. Right into the wound that Pip left. The yeah. arrow's like buries itself in his chest. Yeah. Pip can't even tell that I did it. Yes. The guy drops the, the, dead. The arrow shoots right in. It goes so hard and fast that it goes into the wound so you can't even see it. Yeah. So Pip, it, to Pip, it just looks like he just wrecked Right. And you shit. shot it so hard that the wood and the steel just explodes on the guy's chest and gives him an instant heart attack. And he just goes down gushing blood. So, so now there's. I'm one like, good guy job, Pip. <laughs> Way to swing, buddy. Way to choke up. I love you, Pip. Oh, you got a 20. I love you too, Dad. <laughs> what did I tell you? What did I fucking tell you? Is this a great idea or what? God this is, damn it. This is working. This is turning around. <laughs> okay, so uh, so now, okay, we'll do a hobgoblin count. We got one being standing near Pip, who's kind of friendly still, and then the other guy that's now standing right up at your cart, who's just like, you know, kind of fucked up. Bobo, fuck this dude up. Uh, I swing my, my axe at his knees. What do you say? <laughs> All right. It says, you ever try Axe body spray? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 16. Good job, man. So you got to. Good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you definitely nailed him. So how much? Oh, you do a lot of damage to him, too. Can I use my action surge? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What? It, uh, yeah, yeah. You know, I forget about you and Hyphen's, like, skills, you know. Give me but... an additional action on top of my regular action, but I got to take a nap after. Yeah, you must finish a short or long rest before you can use it again. <laughs> yeah, go for it. So I'm gonna wanna, punch uh, him in the face. You're gonna put just punch him? All right, cool. Yeah. I like that. Wait, are you you taking another shot at the dude that you just cleaved? Oh. Yeah, with my action surge. Yeah, Sam punches him enough that he 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 hits him with the axe right into the shoulder. Or no, right into the knees, right in the knees, so the guy's legs are basically cleaved off. And as he's falling, Sam punches him in the head and snaps his his neck back and he falls down dead. So nice. Badass. Nice. But, Horrible death. Good job. Oh, yeah. This has been a real hit. <laughs> <laughs> Got to work on those catchphrases a little bit. Unprop yeah, that one was unprompted. So that's pretty yeah. cool. Axe yeah. body spray was golden. Yeah, yeah, that was really good. Okay, it's so. to quit when you're ahead. You, uh, yeah, Bobo's you kind of embarrassed at that last line, and he kind yeah. of just, like, skulks down. <laughs> Got to know when you just did your closer. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we're at the other, the, the soul hobgoblin, who's been friendly to this point, but let's see if he can uh, gather the wits to break out of it. <laughs> he rolled a two. So he just looks down like, this is great. You guys are doing really great. <laughs> All right, we got to let Pip take another crack at this guy. <laughs> is, is he the last one left? Yeah, and so now we're at the spiritual weapons turn. Okay. Yeah, we got this. All right, so we just I assume you're just going to swing the spiritual weapon at him. Hey, right. it's on its own, man. All right, cool. Well, should I control it? I mean, really, you would control it. It's your thing. Well, we want Pip to, to get confidence, right? Is there a way we can coordinate have it with Pip? Have the spiritual weapon go into Pip's hand. There you go. You guys want to do that? And then and then attack? Yeah. That's cool. Okay. Sure. All right, so the spiritual weapon flies across the field. And as Pip's going, I love you too, Dad, the spiritual mace flies into his hand like that. And he's like, what? So... <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, uh, so, Peppermint, do you want to take a turn? I mean, because that was your weapon's turn. Do you want to take a turn? Uh, no. Um, okay. My like my my stomach is really upset from that coke. So, <laughs> it's like bubbling or what? That yeah. in in combination with like being nervous for Pip. So I just don't feel very okay. well. So, uh, <laughs> Pe Peppermint takes. Uh, let's see. Her Peppermint stomach starts gurgling, and she takes two hits. Uh, two hit points of. And just kind of has to back and sit down. Two so, hit yeah. points. That's some serious diarrhea. <laughs> Did she just shit her pants? <laughs> no, 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 no. Where do I put my uh, pants how on? many hit points does she have total? She's got 23, so she's lost two. So she'll be all right. Yeah, but like I'm you have so bad diarrhea that you lost 10% of your life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She just took a huge shit in her pants and goes, oh, no. I feel weak. <laughs> I just died 10%. <laughs> Guys, no. It's just my belly. It's just kind of bubbling up and gurgly. That's it. All right? And I'm going to sit down and take a take a rest. Peppermint, I think you might have Crohn's. <laughs> Guys, I don't. God, just seriously. Leave we it alone. The, we you saw the, the gastrointestinal. <laughs> like, 
Yeah, I can't even say it. We saw the two hit points. The two hit points. Stomach gurgled and the two hit and minus two went up from you. Like, <laughs> in red and red numbers. Yeah. <laughs> if you gotta go like pop a squat, pop a squat. Don't hold it in if you're getting killed by this. I'm fine. I am totally fine. Just focus on Pip. Jesus, you're I, making me more nervous. Like he's over the there with the hobgoblin. Do you know how if the next thing that happens is the hobgoblin kills Pip while we're kind of talking to Peppermint about her diarrhea? I think the important <laughs> lesson here is learn how to do your coke. Yes, you don't I, eat the I, fucking coke. If you snorted right. it like a fucking normal person, you'd be <laughs> high as hell and loving life. <laughs> Got it. Understood. Noted. Okay, Fat, uh, it's your turn. So there's only one left near Pip, right? Yeah, and, and I believe <laughs> the goal is to let him do it. If I did magic missile, there's a chance it could hit Pip, isn't there? Yeah, you magic know, missile. Probably, he's pretty close, and if he has happened to fuck up, I mean, if it's a critical miss, you know, I like you guys, but okay. if it's a critical miss, I got to do what I got to do, right? right? And burn the so, fucking kid's head off. So what I do is I uh, I, I go to my email again. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. Uh huh. And I've got a thing called sleep. Yes. And so I uh, I charge it up and I point at the guy next to him and I go, go to sleep. That's like a that's like a spell that you could have you could have put them all to sleep at that just in the future. But that's very powerful. Don't embarrass me in front of my friends. No, I mean, you, huh? Don't embarrass me in front of my friends. I'm new. No, no, no. Oh, well, this is just me talking off grid. Okay, sorry. Anyways, next time, no, you can put out. You probably you can put out three or four guys with that probably. But anyways, this guy falls right to sleep and he now he's deep asleep. And, and I say to and I say to Pip, finish him off, kill him in his sleep, and then I crank Santana. <laughs> All right, let's see how how Sa we're gonna roll for Santana's effect on Pip, and if it does really well, he'll get some damage bonus. Let's see here. Ooh, sixteen. All right, I'll give him plus one for that. Okay, Pip's so, feeling the music. <laughs> he's like, "All right," and so he swings the spiritual weapon. Right, so he gets a let's see, he gets a twelve, and the spiritual weapon gets. Okay, gets an 18, so they fucking hit him. All right. And that, that was Pip swinging that? So that was Pip swinging the weapon. So yeah, that's going to be, because the weapon's turn was to get to him, so that was Pip's turn, so. Who's up? I think, I think it's, it's me, right? Uh, huh? Yeah, it's me, you. right? Yep. Arrow time, baby. Let's see if I can right. do it again. One more. Oh, you got a two. I don't hit oh. Pip, though. That's not that's a... That's not a critical... Damn, that's not critical, okay? But we're going to... We, I, I am going to have to make a roll here and see where it goes. So, okay. So it got a seven. So it flies past Pip. It, it glances off the armor and like goes into the ground behind him. I look over at Hyphen and just start charging everything. <laughs> and I start just charging at me? To, no, start charging all of my magic. He's fine. He's fine. Uh, so I just rolled to see if Pip noticed that it was a one. So Pip has no idea that an arrow almost hit him. So. Good job, Pip. Keep it up, buddy. Keep it up, bud. All right, Bobo, you gonna do anything? This guy's almost dead. Is, does he know he's like, he's not enamored with Pip anymore? He's not, in, well, he was asleep. You know, yeah, that's a good point. Is he still enamored and also asleep? <laughs> he's dreaming about Pip. Okay, yeah. so I rolled an 11 for his, for, for that. So he's getting, he's not enamored anymore, but he's still half asleep. So yeah, he's still, pretty groggy he's he's just kind of shaking up on the ground starting to try to get up he's like kind of starting to try to stand but he's still like kind of asleep right but he's definitely shaking off the effects of the charm i walk up to pip and i say you got this <laughs> all right that's what you do yeah well, let's see how it does Why even walk up there why not just say it from where we all are because that's I, what he wanted to do I want... all right so yeah so pip goes yeah thank you babo <laughs> And you didn't know this whole time that he was, that's how he pronounces your name. That's how people are laughing. Like, 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 Babo. Babo. Like a weird kid saying Babar. Thank you, Babo. That's what I'm calling him from now, Babo. <laughs> Pip can call okay. me that. You can't call me that. All right. So the hobgoblin. <clears throat> okay, so the hobgoblin starts to wake up, but he's still kind of not really there he's he's now standing but he's still kind of groggy and he's starting to kind of shake his head like wipe his eyes out a little bit but he's not quite all there yet peppermint oh spiritual weapons turn are we still doing that yeah, yeah. how many turns it's not, is in pip's hand? it's not pip's turn no it's pip's, spiritual weapon in pip's pip, hand oh, oh the spiritual oh. weapons in pip's hand so it can swing at it and pip won't even really know that it's not him 
I really want Pitt to finish him. Finish well, him off. Thing. Yeah, yeah. Have yeah. the spiritual weapon do it though. Yeah, it's in his yeah, hand. Yeah. He won't even know. He probably okay. won't know. Okay. So the the mace flies through, and you know Pip doesn't realize it, but the mace is pulling fl- Pip's arm right. And it kind of flies like that right into the side of the head. It gets brains the the hobgoblin, and like the spike ball goes into the side of his head, and goop flies out, and he falls down dead. Yeah. Attaboy, Pip. Oh. Attaboy, Pip. Yeah. That's Way to go, I, buddy. All right. How us Buckersons do it. That Pip, gets was an that the first time you killed like, anyone? He's feeling no. your energy. What? That's like, Pip, was that the first time you killed anyone? You look that, awesome, dude. That looked like yes. maybe it was like the fifth or sixth time you killed someone. What, what, one pro. time I went hunting with father and I killed a turkey, but he was holding my hands the whole time with the bow. So he, it was more that father killed the turkey. I'm like, it's fun, right? It's fun. Yeah. yeah. I did now, now, Pip. Yes. You're not done yet, buddy, because now comes the most special part of the killing. <laughs> you got to arrange these four hobgoblins in the most hilarious and depraved sexual position that you can imagine. So off you go. Finish it up. Is he doing this by himself? Well, we'll help him. He's got to call the shots. He's got to. He's got to. It's, it's okay. his idea, though. He's got to. He's, he's right, telling so he has, What's okay, he come up with? He's directing. So, so Pip takes a Pip takes a moment, and he just kind of uh, walks off into the grass a little bit, just really thinking about it. And the mage armor dissipates off of him. We right? watch from a distance. We're like, come on. Man. Right. And I'm the, filming the this on my phone. I'm filming this. Like, the this spiritual weapon kind of just like turns to mist in his hand, and he's just kind of now he's by himself. He's just a regular kid again. And uh, he rolls a three as he's thinking of these ideas. So <laughs> he just takes the three, the bodies that just kind of rolls them all up together into like just a kind of a stack, like he puts two together and then he just kind of puts, tries to roll the other two on top of them. So just like a stack of four bodies, like logs. Like a pyramid? Goes, huh? Look, look, is this, is this a sex move? <laughs> like, yeah, you sure. Yeah. Okay. You did. Um, I, I got to go to the bathroom. Can we get in the cart and keep moving here? Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. I get in the back of the cart and take a nap. Okay. All right. So we get back in the cart. Get back in the cart. Okay. Rob Thomas and Santana on the speaker. I'm, I, you rocked I'm, it, Pip. I'm, I'm really, a... really concerned about my stomach. And I know that I have one spell that's like a, it's like a holding spell. And I, I put a holding spell on my bowels so I don't okay. make a mess in the cart. Oh, I like that. All right. So that's the, it's called hold person, but yeah, I bet it can work on your own person. <laughs> and of course, I picked, I picked hold person. Why do you think I picked hold person? I know exactly why you picked hold person. <laughs> For me. I saw hold it, me, you fuck. Yeah, when I saw it, I'm like, oh, of yeah. course you picked I was like, that. oh, hold person. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that sounds it's so nice. It's going to work out great. Okay, so you're basically, so what you're trying to do, because hold person kind of paralyzes someone, right? Um, yeah, so you're right? You don't paralyze... want to paralyze your bowels. Yeah. Is that yeah, what they're going to, well, if you roll a one, you're shitting your pants. <laughs> yeah. Or, if you roll perhaps, a five, you're shitting your pants. Perhaps yes. explosively. All right, here we go. If you shit on Pip, that would be hilarious. This is going to be so, so embarrassing. All right, so yeah, you, uh, you do not beat the difficulty. You do not successfully paralyze yourself. Um, Basically, what happens is is you now you just start to feel your stomach wobble more, and like things are really moving around in there. So you're not yeah. shitting yourself, but you've definitely increased the speed. Are we aware I, of what's going I'm, on with peppermint? No, I've got it all inside, inside. <laughs> I'm not. I'm acting cool and everything. I cross <laughs> my legs and I like clench everything really like, tightly. All right, peppermint. Okay, yeah. Let's see how let's see how people Good. pick up on this. Okay. You don't look all right. Why are you crossing Let, your legs? Yeah, let's see how high fit. We'll, we'll go around the room and see who's trying a new. I'm not sitting thing. on her lap, am I? I'd like to know. <laughs> yeah. No, everybody's. You yeah. have nowhere else to sit, buddy. <laughs> That's <laughs> right. Cart. There's not yeah, enough room. Last time. Okay, so uh, Fut does not notice anything. No. Um, okay, hyphen. Hyphen got a 15. So hyphen, you are. I'm like, you're farting a lot, Peppermint. <laughs> it's not me. It's, it's both not you. It, well, how come no. your fucking skirt okay. is like billowing and it smells like death? It's and not Bobo billowing. A, it's Bobo not a cartoon. Got an 18. So Bubble, oh. like, you've seen this happen before. You've partied yeah. enough. You know when someone. Bubble, I'm going to come sit on your lap, dude. 
I'm coming over. I like, I like that. Like, I mean, all right, man. Uh, Peppermint must be mortified that Hyphen noticed because that's the person she would probably least want to notice because she's yeah. sweeter. That's can, right. Uh, can we do an agility check on me saying doorknob? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's do it. All right. Okay, you got a 16, bro. Okay, cool. You do say doorknob. Yeah, fi oh, 50 because you get minus one. Doorknob. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you say doorknob. All right. Does that mean you get to punch her in the arm? Well, let's see if she says safety. Okay. <laughs> she got a three for that. Oh, so she, she government just look at Bubba and says, what door? <laughs> Bubba's got a puncher now. Where? Uh, yeah, so I punch her in the arm. <laughs> All right, so he gets a nine. So he gives you a pretty good whack. We'll give you a little bit of just like, you take another two hit points of damage. Does she shit her pants when he hits her in the arm? This oh diarrhea, this diarrhea has no. Does does the hit jar loose her bowels? I've I've mean, already taken four hit points from this diarrhea. Yeah, yeah two from Sam. Well, and two from Bobo too. It's still All diarrhea right. related, but it's fair. It was not a hard enough punch to like get anything going. Okay, can I um can I use uh, can, if I do a spell, can people see it? Like, do sparkles come out of me or something? Or can I do a covert spell? It kind of depends on what you're doing. Like, can, you I, can, I use, can I use sleep to put uh, Peppermint Sphincter to sleep so she shits herself? Well, you, you just, don't know that I have a sphincter problem. I just you called you out. I just announced it to the whole car because oh, I smelled your fart. I said right. so. I thought it would be funny. Okay. And I said it was Bobo. Where's my charisma? Wait, oh, right. Yeah, we got to. I'm sorry. Things were happening too fast. Let's see if anyone believed it was Bobo. Wait. We are never getting to chapter eight. <laughs> just so we know, Darren specifically just now asked for a charisma check to see, and I roll a four. So, so we're all like, uh, you obviously are farting. Like, <laughs> like, it's like every, everyone in the cart goes, Peppermint, we know what orc farts smell like. Yeah, you're a huge <laughs> monster. Is that huge? this small? Like, that is a huge monster fart we smell. <laughs> well, what do you guys propose I do? Uh, do cocaine through your nose or your ass like a real human being. Yeah, hindsight's twenty twenty. What do I do right now? Do I get out of the car, <laughs> if you go somewhere, or do we go to a town and I can find a bathroom, man? Can we can we get Trevor's sphincter roll going? Because I'm dying to know if his if his sleep spell works or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He can't do the, the sleep spell though. He just used it. He just used. I, so I was looking at you my want me to shit in the car? Do it again. <laughs> I mean, like I was, that's what you want me to do. I think it'd be funny. Are you the only orc in existence that is not okay with shitting in the woods? Yeah, what is your deal? I yeah. prefer a, a potty. She's a lady. <laughs> yeah. You're an orc with a battle axe, but you need a toilet. Yeah. <laughs> she did fuck a man in a, in a cage in a cave. <laughs> Why do we have to keep bringing up the past? I'm trying to move forward. Let's Get the cartwheels turning here and go. <laughs> the cartwheels. Oh, man. Okay. So, uh, well, let, here, here's what we'll do. We'll just uh, – Fut's uh, going to try this again, but he's not going to get any modifiers, so it's probably going to be harder. Got Because you just did it, right? And you got to no give – sparkles. No one can see that I'm doing this. Okay. So okay, you, you get a ten, so it doesn't work. But let's ah. see how. Uh, it, well, <laughs> and I rolled a three for your stealth, so you go like this, and they go, "Oh damn it!" So every <laughs> people, everybody kind of sees you go like this, and the like sparkles went everywhere. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're all like, "What the fuck, fuck?" Like, what wait, are you, are you like trying little... to make an orc shit in the back seat where Bobo and sparkles. I are? And can we turn off the Santana music? The bass is like making my <laughs> stomach very. Smooth. Like, let's go. Let's go. Hey, okay. uh, uh, Come on, everybody. How, how's your diarrhea feel? Does it feel like, oh, it's a hot one? <laughs> <laughs> Seven inches from the midday sun. <laughs> I mean, Pepper, you, could, you could sit around here worrying about your, your stomach, but why don't you forget about it? <laughs> okay. Let's see how she likes that one. Oh, you got a one. So Ooh, she's pissed. So what is she? What happens? 
Um, well, I get super, super pissed at Bobo <laughs> for this. And um, I uh, stand up on the cart and I turn around and I spread my cheeks <laughs> with the intention of spraying diarrhea all over him. And that's my move. That's, <laughs> and that's my move. Do it. It's just threatening. I'm sitting on Bobo's oh. lap now because I moved over to him. I'm like, no. Bummer, oh dude. God. Bummer. Are we leaving this to the dice now? All yes. right. Okay. That's a 14. That shit definitely comes out of your butt. Oh. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, She's already oh forget oh, about it. I think that between my legs. I thought her move was holding it open. What? Uh, She's trying to shit? No, she's shitting. Yeah, she's, she's shitting. aiming her butthole at you, right? All right. And I roll to Do leap out of the way. I'm, yeah, okay. I yes, see what's let's... happening, and I dive to the front seat. Okay, yeah, let's Saving let's roll. Hyphen. Saving roll. Yeah, saving, saving roll, roll for hyphen Padma 7. Roll. Yeah, well, just saving rolls. Okay. So basically, that was a roll to see if the if she can, like, you know, adequately pump that poop out of her button. That's It's coming. So, oh. all right. So, uh, hyphen. You got an 18. You... You uh, you see, you you see like her butt cheeks quiver, and you just jump off of Bobo's <laughs> lap out of the way into the side of the cart, and uh, into Pip. You kind of land on Pip, and he's okay though. He's still jazzed for the battle. So you guys are in a pile. All right. So Fut, what are you gonna do? Dive. You're gonna try and get out of the way. Or Bobo? So what oh, exactly is happening front. with my diarrhea right now? Is it flying? It's blasting or out of your it... butt like a like a hose. And it's just slamming Bobo in the face. Well, no, we're no, about no, to find yeah. out if he gets slammed. He, he gets to do uh, a uh, saving throw to see if he can get out of the way. So, oh, uh, I see. Yep. So, so a uh, hyphen got out of the way. Yeah. I, uh, I hold my axe up. Okay. Well, you, you only got your a axe up. You like, got a like, as, as like a, a, a shield. Okay, well, you, you got a three for, for getting out of the way, so you're not getting out of the way. So you hold up your shield, and let's see. He drops his axe. It's going to just go past your shield and coat okay. you and fucking. So you're, uh, so, so your, your axe, you, you, got a, you got a 12. So you hold up your axe, but you don't turn the head that well. So it just kind of like diverts. Like <laughs> most of the poop still flies at you, but you, some of it diverts and it splashes towards foot. And, uh, oh, it's definitely coming for you, Fudd. So uh, you're going to, we're going to roll. Like, because, you know, he's holding the flat of the axe, so it like bounces off of it towards you. So, uh, yeah, you, you get out of the way, though. So, like, there's shit flying off of the axe out the side of the cart. And this, then... this right here is the moment I would like artists to render. <laughs> this moment. <laughs> As it careens off of the axe towards this is the, the next, front seat. This is the next T-shirt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sam holding up a battle axe with shit oh. flying everywhere. <laughs> All of us in a car, peppermint in the back seat, shitting at Bobo, bouncing into the front seat, just mayhem. I, I know less and less people watch every episode, but I like that we're trying to see how low we can get the numbers. <laughs> Spending a whole episode about diarrhea. Does YouTube viewers do negatives? Do they do negative numbers? <laughs> All right, so. Uh. so um, Bobo, you you have a face full of orc uh, shit. I thought I blocked some. You blocked some, oh. but I mean, it still got you in the face. I mean, this it's is a face like... full. It should be a face full. I should have some shit on me, but not a. Full. You rolled you a have three. A mouth full. You have a mouthful. You're just. No, no, the three was for dodging. The, yeah, so the, he got yeah. I got a uh, bunch of poop hit you, and then you got a decent roll with the axe, but you still get hit with some of it. So yeah, some of it. Uh, I don't know. Well, let's see. Well, it's let's not let's in my out. mouth. Let's figure this out. So. Okay. I don't get why you get two. You get one to dodge and one to block. Shouldn't you just well, get that's one? That's what I did. No, I'm going to roll for the poop, like how well it does. And I got a 15. So, like, it, it got, it still got on you. You got poop You're on you. You're fucking covered in shit, dude. No, I got poop I on me. I'm not covered. He's got poop on. Okay. Let me just. You rolled a three part. to evade, and he rolled a 15 to get you Listen a poop. Listen to the dungeon master. But Listen. he also, but he also held up his axe and deflected all right with the axe, you know. But but the thing is, Sam, it's also just an axe. It's not a shield. He got a flat piece of metal. Some of it flew at fuck, but there's still it's me. No, no, I got. I get. I get. Get, a bunch of poop with a stick. I get. I'm getting some. It's but it's a, a wide axe. Okay, and Timmy, can you draw what Sam looks like right now? <laughs> Real quick, I don't have a pen. All right, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, I so, think but, uh, if I didn't do anything, I'd be covered in shit. Right, but, but I did something. Okay, so so basically, you, you have it's some in your hair. Okay, you definitely have a little bit of poop on your face and your hair. You have a good size splat on your chest, right? Because you're holding up the axe like this, so yeah. like this and a little bit up here. Okay, 
So yeah. I, I think that's a democratic way to cover you in some shit. <laughs> I mean, yeah. if Darren Does weighs like 600 pounds right. and, I mean, and has major lava diarrhea. Yeah, this is like a fire hose of shit. Yeah, no, no, yeah, yeah. yeah. And the, the, little, the little baggie comes out with the little, <laughs> the little white paper and the black spider on it. Yeah, there we go. There's a great way to get back into it the It lands right on his chest. There you go. I like the that. Permit, do you say anything as you shit oh. all over Bobo? <laughs> yeah, I say, did you forget about it? And then I sit down. <laughs> Da, 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 uh, da. All right, uh, do I have a move? Yeah, hold on. Um, but uh, 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 Pip really liked Peppermint's line, so he starts okay. doing a little golf clap. Okay, Bubba, what do you want to do? I want to kick uh, uh, Peppermint in the butt off the cart. <laughs> She's oh. down four hit points already. <laughs> you just shat on me. <laughs> well, you, you missed her with the kick. You got a nine. Right. Because so, it's because it's slippery, so you lost your footing. Yeah. Thank you, thank you for the idea. But so, all right. So, Bubble kicks at her, and this isn't a critical fail. So, but he does slip back on a little bit of shit, and he sits back down on the bench, and so he gets a little bit of shit on the seat of his pants too. And I and I say to Bubbo, I say, hey, Bubbo, you gotta be careful with all the shit on the floor because it's so smooth. <laughs> this time, it's good enough, I guess. And I go to and I go to. Uh, 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 but and I say, thanks for being a good friend, and I give him a big hug. <laughs> <laughs> how, many, how many turns does Bobo get here? I don't this know. is crazy. Just Can we just move? But we gotta down do a saving. Now we gotta do a saving. This throw. is crazy. You're the one who shit on me. <laughs> okay. Uh, Fud only rolled a six for the saving throw, so he does get you in a good, a good bear hug. Ugh. <laughs> yeah. I don't even care though. <laughs> I start just slopping it off of me. <clears throat> hey, Bo, come on, Bobo. Bobo. Don't be an animal. Yeah. All right. He and, says, Bobo, and I, Bobo, Bobo, Bobo. Yeah, be, he says be, that. Be brave like, like me. Pip, Pip's talking to him. Bobo. Yeah, be brave like Pip, be Bobo. Like no, no, I'm good. What? I'm just slopping it off of me. Okay. Uh, you That only rolls a two. Pip knows that you're really upset. <laughs> He's like, okay, Bobo. I say, hey, Pip, I don't ever want you to behave like Bobo, okay? I'm so worried about Bobo, hyphen. <laughs> don't worry about him. He's, he's an idiot. And I say, all right, guys, I'm back. I feel better. Let's go. Let's move okay. along. So no, let, let's, let's get it. Let's, uh, so the cart's going up the hill. So you're, you're finally cresting the hill after all that. And you're, Wait a minute. We don't have to go to the bathroom anymore, right? So we don't have to stop. You're, you're good now. Yeah. I'd like to stop. Oh, I'd also God. really would like to stop and hose this cart down because it, it smells like absolute death. Okay. Is so, like a rest stop? Right, we go to a gas station. I am trying to fucking get to a place, you guys. Shut up. Oh, just God. hold on. Darren starts making up gas stations. I'm like, I have a paragraph. I got it. I got your. It's not a gas station. I see I'm a sorry. Wawa. Okay. I say, let's There's go a, to the Wawa. Let's, we're, we're going to the Wawa. We're going, we're going to Wawa. Wawa. It's got the touch screen sandwiches. So as you crest a low ridge, you spy the crumbling ruins of an old watchtower standing amid the rugged hills. The place is so old that the walls are mounds of rubble. A colorful tent has been set up in the middle of the courtyard, but no one is in sight. Okay, let's go to the tent. They got to have a hose. They got to have some kind of water. We got to spray this shit down. Bobo. Peppermint, you guys got to get cleaned up. This is no good. Wait, does, should we send one person to go and investigate, or do we just all head towards it? Let's just I go. I don't want to behave out here get, while somebody snoops, breathing in your diarrhea. I, I don't care. Let's just get fucking cleaned It doesn't there. smell that bad to me. It Who's smells gonna, terrible. Yeah. No one's going to ambush us. We're all covered in shit. No one's going to want to be near us. Yeah. Only Pip and I don't have shit all over us. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so I you guys are either. all getting out of the cart and heading over to this old tower? I think. How about we have non shit people go get to do the tent thing, and people who have shit on them have to stay behind and clean the, clean the cart? I'm not clean. Oh, you're definitely helping cleaning. But, Peppermint, you have, I mean, Peppermint, you've had diarrhea. I mean, yeah, you're not, not covered in shit. You have poop all over your butt yeah. and your thighs and stuff. You know, you just sprayed shit everywhere. No, it was projectiles, very directional. Listen, and it just, well, it just I, went all in Sam's eyeballs and his mouth. No, I didn't decide that. Ed, okay, first of all, I've had fat, I've had a flabby butt and thighs and real bad diarrhea before, and I know that you are not clean. <laughs> yeah, 
Hey, can fucking we, wipe you, animal. Hey, can we can we roll to see if Bobo gets pink eye? <laughs> That's good. How do you do? I, I, I think we can figure that out. Okay, so, all right. Let, let's just see if pink eye can get a better roll than Bobo's got, like, health. Okay, so... His constitution, no, okay. So, no, I only rolled a 10 for pink eye. Bobo's constitution is 15, so he's going to be okay. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get pink eye. <laughs> I dip all my arrow tips in the diarrhea. Mm. Ooh. Now I have poison arrows. Okay, so yeah, what now you your quiver to... smells like shit. Yeah, it so, does. So hyphen as soon and... as I find a river, I'm going to rinse these arrows off. It was not worth it. Hyphen and Pip are uh, what you guys are gonna go ahead or what? Can I can I do a charm person magic to make Bobo think that the the shit looks delicious? <laughs> I don't know. This you is can... a good idea. Again, this is a good just idea. Used it. He did just use his charm, and you definitely have not rested since then because you like all you all this happens since then is like a shit fountain. I'm trying to do it covertly. I don't want anyone to see my sparkles again. You, okay, well. I gotta give you, yeah. I gotta give you. I can't give you bonuses here because you're trying to do too many things. You know, you're gonna tie yourself out. Okay. I've been doing coke for like three days. I'm not gonna get tired. <laughs> I mean, it's like it's 14 to 14. So you, you, you kind of. Let's see how. Let's get. Let's have. Uh, it's it's not that great of a role, but let's have Bobo do a do an intelligence check here and see. I'm just so happy that Peppermint stood up. <laughs> <laughs> just okay. diarrhea all over Bobo. Bobo got an 18, so Bob, this did not work on Bobo. Yeah. So Bobo's Can we like, stop doing stuff to Bobo? <laughs> so, so Bobo just shot, shouts out loud for no reason. He goes, I would never eat that. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I'm like, Bobo, why would you say that? Why are you yeah. even thinking of eating that? What? Ask, what? ask the fucking wizard. <laughs> Ask Armbar Wizard over here. Hey, look, if, if I do shit, you see sparkles. No one saw sparkles. Yeah, because you're bad. <laughs> you're bad at being what? a wizard. Wait a minute. What happened? I don't understand. <laughs> I'll you tried to We're get all me hanging out, covered in shit, and then <laughs> Bobo says, out of the fucking blue, I would never eat that. <laughs> yeah, what do you think happened? Okay. Wait, are you talking about my diarrhea? <laughs> I'm talking about fucking, fucking, uh, uh, fuck over here. I okay. didn't do anything, man. Fucking dickhead wizard. So Bo Bobo rolled a 12 for charisma, and Futz, I didn't do anything, man, got a seven. <laughs> I'm just up uh, here listening to Rob Thomas in the front seat. I'm just hanging out. Like, I'm not, I'm not fucking with you. Hmm. I look at the other guys like, let's just give him a second. Can we, can we go to this tent and clean this shit yeah. off? Can we just, like, be yeah, grown-ups okay. for a beat? Yeah. Uh oh. Oh. I don't know why you're all self-righteous, Bobo. You're talking about eating diarrhea. You're I'm antagonizing a diarrhea. sick person until they shit on you. I'm what kind of about eating diarrhea? I said you're talking about eating it. <laughs> hey, okay. Flicker. So, uh, so what are we doing? Um, a couple of you are going over to towards the tower. <clears throat> I think yep. we should all go uh, to the tower. They got to have a hose, right? Let's let's I, let's hose ourselves down, please. Okay. You so guys. Or we we can go find another uh, like uh, another cart or some horses or some other. If shit. there's okay. another cart, we should take it. So you're so you're heading towards you're heading towards the, the uh, tower, and you know that you guys have been traveling all day. You stop for the battle, so it's dusk. So you know the sun is starting to set, and um, so you're approaching the tower. It's getting a little hard to see. Besides the, the bright red colored tent, you're, it, you can't really see if anything else is there unless maybe take a closer look. I go, shit, guys, it's almost, it's dusk. Who's doing a comedy show at our bar? <laughs> Fuck. Did we, we announced that we were, there was going to be live comedy every night, didn't we? Yeah. Can you call somebody? Do we know anyone in that town? Pip, do you know, Pip, Pip. Do you know yes, anybody yes, in Fandling that's funny? That's like actually funny though, not okay. like lame. I'm pretty funny. You're here, Pip. You're here, oh. dude. What, what are you talking yeah. about? He only rolled an eight, so. Also, Pip, I'm sorry. You're not fucking funny at all. You're cool, and you're a great fighter, and you killed a lot yeah. of fucking hobgoblins. And you're very Never humble. made me laugh. Yeah, that you guys only got a seven on Pip, and let's see what Peppermint's, uh, that was I, a 17. So I, he's like, she's I, right. I'm fucking worthless as a comedian. I take hyphen aside. I'm Aww. like, oh, the fucking kitty's not funny. He's not. He's fucking not funny. 
fucking. Hey, he's not. He's not funny yet. Pip, you're learning. All yeah, right. No one, Did you see far. what he tried to do with those those hobgoblin bodies? That was like super fucking the opposite I mean, of hilarious. It was yeah. anti comedy. It was deconstructing. Yeah, it was the death the of comedy thing. You know. Well, I, tell Pip, I think you're funny. Can I look at the tower? Okay, Bobo's gonna take a look at the tower. So, Bobo, you you raise a a, a shit crusted hand to your eyes to help look out at the tower and uh, off. I'm not touching my eyes or anything. Right, it's above. It's on your forehead, right? So, okay. So, all right, you get a fifteen. So, so you do see uh, in the red tent, you see uh, somebody sitting down inside the tent, and then kind of shambling around the outskirts of the tower, you see twelve zombies. Oh shit! They're outside the tent, and the tent looks like bright and new, right? The tent is right. The the tent is not old and shambly, but there's an old crumbling tower, right? And inside, you also see you notice you know the tower is like there's some arches crumbling. So you can see into the tower pretty well. And there's a well in the middle, and uh, so there's all these zombies around. There's twelve zombies, and then there's this like brightly colored kind of red tent sitting there. And yeah, the tent has clearly only been up for you know and, maybe a day and, or two. But, are this, can we get to the tent without interacting with the zombies? Well, you probably can. Should we see? Well, I say, hey, guys, you know, uh, there's a well there, and there's water in wells. That might be where that fucking whale is that... Uh, that has that the cocaine. Was, that the guy was telling us about. I'm or there might be a hose there, and we can hose off the cart with the water in the well. All right, guys, do you want me to stealthily go peek into the tent? Maybe there's a bucket and a hose, maybe some scrubby shit in there. Yeah. Uh, Yes. All right. Yes. All right. Okay. So let's do a stealth check if you can creep. Now this is a good distance, but you know you're good at this. So. All right. So you get a 14, which isn't terrific. But oh no, what you get to no, you get a it's 17. So you add more to it. So okay. So you you sneak up all the way up up to the tent pretty well. Um, let me get let me. It's a little guy. He's kind of chubby and he's My wearing size? a red. Huh? My size. He he's a human, so he's a little taller than you, but he's short and old. And he's uh, got his shaved head. He has a black tattoo on his forehead, okay? And he's wearing a red robe. And his skin is kind of very pale and very kind of sunken in, too, in his face. And he's sitting in the middle of this tent with a, with a big spell book out and kind of chanting to himself. All right. I, should, I'm going to not talk to him. I'm going to go back to the dudes. That's so like creep back to <laughs> okay. the guys. Like We'll do back a creep, a creep back. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the creep back doesn't go as well. So uh, you only you only got about an wow. eight for that. So we're going to see if some zombies notice you. That one doesn't. Uh, that one doesn't. Eh, okay, we're all for like one more. Okay, so one zombie does notice you and starts shambling over to you. Um, but, you know, zombies move slowly. So let's give I'm gonna you... I'm going to arrow this motherfucker. You're going to shoot the zombie? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to take him down quiet. No one else will know. I turned the Santana. Yeah, you do hit it. You did hit it. I I turned the Santana really low, like very quiet. Not off, not off, but like <laughs> not like so that they won't hear it. Right. That's thoughtful, you know. That's I hit him. Yeah, so you hit him and you do these guys are tough but they're slow and dumb. So you did uh you did eight damage, so he's still they have twenty two hit points, so Jesus Christ. Yeah, Jesus. That's a each hobby. one? Yeah, that's a So lot. we like really shouldn't fight these zombies, dude. There's yeah. twelve of them at twenty two hit points. You know they're not that uh, they're not that good. They're just tough. I mean they're like zombies. You know how in a movie you shoot the zombie a bunch unless you can hit it in the head. Yeah, how much how much strength do they have? Well, yeah. their attacks don't do a whole lot if they hit you. Oh, okay. The evil mage inside definitely hears you, so he starts coming out of the tent. He's evil. So he says he says what is the meaning of this? But uh, and he and then he uh, well, I'm gonna roll again, but uh, yeah. So he he, uh, he pretty much sees you, Hyphen. He goes, what is the meaning of this? What are you doing? I say, sir, we are just five weary travelers who desperately are in seek of a hose and a bucket and some soap. Uh, we had an unfortunate accident on the road with uh, our orc over here. Uh, you could probably smell wow. Um, you can look, Bobo, this guy right here, he's covered in shit. Basically what him. happened is she, is she ate some Coke and then he was antagonizing her. And I guess she lost her temper and then she stood up and kind of fire hosed him. And then that, that he got teased by him. And so to get him back, he started hugging him. So now he's got it. And so basically, you know, the three of them in the car, it's a whole nasty, I don't you don't even want to know the whole details, but 
Yeah, that that did pretty well. You got an eighteen on that, so he's a. I mean, your your charisma is always pretty good. So, so he goes. So if we could just use your well. Yeah. I can let you into the well. I've been studying this place for information about the, your whole uh, life story. We just need to get this shit off of us. <laughs> Every fucking time. All right. And I got a fifty. He goes fine. I, I if, if that's all you want to do. I, I'm not going to tell you about Arthur and all his spells from Netheril. Fine. You, like, just negged him. You, like, respected you for being an asshole to him. <laughs> Wait, I, I mean... He's, like, I, insecure, I think. Okay. I'll so, throw my hat in the ring. I kind of want to hear a little bit about the spells, or are we... Yeah. So could you could you get the shit off of you, and then we can talk to the dude yeah. about the spells? Can we get <laughs> first, first? Talk later. Okay. All right, so... Uh, so the uh, the mage says, yes, you can go to the well. My name is Haman Koss, and he waves his hands, and the zombies kind of walk out farther away from the tower to, you know, they kind of move away from the tower so you guys can head in towards the well. That was badass. So, um, all right. All right, so washy, 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 scrubby, scrubby. Yeah, so, scrubby. so the well has actual clean, fresh water in it. Oh, thank God. Sweet. Um, but uh, inside, you do see a, a couple of, of, of crates, you know, wooden crates with the black spider stamped on them, right? And you do see some mining equipment around. Oh, is that Blow? This is Cocaine City. Trevor, go, go, uh, fight, go shove some of that up your ass. See if it's real. I take a handful of it. I put it in my ass. Okay. And the, you, you got an 11. So, like, you got up there pretty good. And you, you get your hand out a little bit, but, like, your hand was just clean. And now you got out again, so it smells a little bit. And then uh, wash your hand. The put it back in the well. Yeah, so you have to wash it again. Because... I wash for 20 seconds. Right. Happy birthday twice. Yep. Yep. Okay. Hey, Peppermint, don't eat any of this. I won't. <laughs> All right. So let's just uh, let's load this stuff into the cart, right? All of okay. it. Yeah. And we're gonna just sell it in Fandolin. Well, Should we go back to Fandolin and? Well, like, so 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 Haman Koss says, "No, you you can't take that. That's on its way to Fandolin." Uh, yeah, we're going. Yeah, to we're taking yeah. it there. It's on it. its way to Fandolin. It's yeah. ours. This is coming. This is coming through Thunder Tree to Fandolin. I mean, th it's on its way. If, if you take this, the Black Spider will know. We don't need the Coke's life story. We can just <laughs> okay. bring it to Fandolin. And that's that got a you got a one for your convincing him there. So he says, Listen, motherfuckers, I have all these zombies around you. You leave the coke here and move on towards Thunder Tree, or else I'll call everybody on you. I I, I do sleep on him. You can't do sleep anymore, I mean, right? But uh, you know, you're, you're so like two times. <laughs> I do think we should be sensitive to the 20. How many zombies are here? There's 12 yeah. zombies. 12 powerful zombies in this guy i did they're just... far away if we if this fucker goes to sleep they're not going to come back they're they're on their thing also i would love to let's let's see if we could just get this guy to tell us where we get more of this i mean it's cool that we're going to take all of this stuff but like where's it come from yeah teach a man to fish this will know. last us like two nights that's it i mean we need more okay all right so uh you guys want to maybe talk to him a little bit more or what do you want yeah. to do yeah, yeah, we'll talk to him. Who wants to talk to him? I'll take a crack at it. Okay, so. Uh, right, so oh, go what ahead. was your name, dude? Uh, Haman. What? Ha Haman Cost. All right, we're going to call you Carl. All right. Carl? 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 Yeah. Carl, we, we, uh, we're going to be taking this, and we would like to know where the rest of it comes. Where is this produced? Mm. Today. So this is, <laughs> I don't know where it originates from. I know that it comes through Thunder Tree and uh, that's uh, at the other end of Thunder Tree is a Cragmaw Castle where they have another stop. There is a, there's a station of orcs there that they check it, they send it to me and then they come and send it through Vandalin. I'm only doing it because he's funding my research here in the Thaumaturgy. Which is, okay. a, a, that, that means zombie magic. Okay, this doesn't have to go sideways. We can work together, okay? You send us this. Well, we, we live in Fandolin. We have a very successful club there. Uh, what is our club called? Do you like comedy? White Tavern Inn. Oh yeah, we own the White Tavern Inn. Yeah. There's great you, sketch you, comedy every night of the week. We're famous uh, comedians. You should come by. We could, you know, 
Chris Rock could show up. You never know who could drop in. Uh, look, so here's the thing. We're, we're, we're going to take the Coke, okay? And, and we're, uh, but, you know, what we could do is we're going to sell it through our club that, that we do our shows at, and we could cut you in a little bit. You keep it coming. We'll keep the, the money train flowing both ways or whatever it is. You know, we'll, we'll, this is going to work out for everybody. Yeah, you we'll can have more, you... more than a tent here. The whole palace. Yeah, you live in yeah. a tent. We'll give you 2% of the cut and we keep 98%. Okay. Or, or we okay. fight and there's, and there's five of us and we're, we've like not lost a battle yet. And you've got 12 dudes who are like, they're not even, they don't even have brains. They're like, you know, we're going to win. They don't have brains because I took them out to study them and brought their bodies back to life we, with we my don't powerful care. We don't magic. So that. I feel it like you're matter. misunderstanding my abilities, matter. but also I do like Chris Rock. Carl, <laughs> thank you. I do, yes. Chris Rock, I like Chris Rock. Uh, my name is Haven, but that's fine. Um, I don't live in this tent. I'm like here studying, right? It's like, you know, in Jurassic Park where they have that tent at the Dude, beginning. What do you think is happening right now? Like, what, what is, uh, like, are we, like, what is this? What are you doing? We're not interviewing you yeah. it's for just, a magazine. But like, you know, because every, every time you, you, every time you meet someone uh, that's not you, let's call them a non-player character. They may have something going on in their lives that they share with you to tr kind of uh, enrich the story and perhaps send you on a new quest or something. So this you know? is part of the game. We're supposed to, we have to listen to all these guys' stories. <laughs> <laughs> I need to know something. Okay. If you can find that out for me, I'll give you the Coke to give back to Fandolin, and I won't say shit. We're to taking the, the Coke, Carl. It, okay, you're not giving us the Coke. We're taking the Coke. Not any favors here, buddy. <laughs> we're, we're offering you a percent of, of the set. We're doing all the hard work, by the way. We're, we're transporting it. We're, we're distributing it, distributing it, right? <laughs> we're gonna, not we're giving gonna... me enough of the money. So he says enough of this and he snaps his fingers and three zombies start walking towards you. Oh, what the fucking zombies? Right. Okay. If really, I can throw dude? my javelin at one of the zombies. Wait, wait, Bobo, 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 bo, bo, please. Hang on, Bobo. If you, if, if we fight these guys, it's gonna be a whole thing. We're gonna lose our distribution. We, we, we need, we kind of need this guy, right? So let's, let's, can we, can we just take a beat? Here's the thing. Yeah. If he's got no zombies, he has less leverage. Yeah, but he's got 12 zombies, dude. I have been studying an old wizard and his culture here, okay? Now, I'm looking for the name of the wizard that lived here, and the only person, the, everything I studied to find out who knows the name of this guy, all I can find out is it's a lady named Agatha. I can't fucking find Agatha anywhere. Wait, that's the fucking uh, stripper. Yeah. yeah. That's the stripper lady. A uh, who? We met the stripper lady yesterday. She we is. know Agatha. Yeah, that she stole a, a dollar from me. Is she blue green? She's probably a wraith. That's what it says here. She's like a banshee, right? She was kind of wispy and loud. Okay. Yeah. Dude, we can talk to, to those barbarian ladies. They might they might know because they knew enough to bring in the silver comb. They know more than us about Agatha. We could okay, we could we could do some digging around and, and get some answers for you. But we're gonna need this coke as a show of good faith. Yeah. All right? And then you hear a yell from back towards your cart. Why don't you ask me right now? And you oh, turn around. Here. Fucking awesome. Yeah. Standing by the cart is Halia with a tied up trust mosque. Sick. And she's with a guy and she's with uh, Antonin Scalia. They've both survived and they've got mosques all beat up and tied with them. And there's yeah. a man with them too. Awesome. This yeah. is working out. Okay. Right. What's up? What happened to uh, the, the other monster? The Nothic? Well, I mean, you yeah. have to go up and talk to these guys. All right, so we go out, we go talk to him. You're going to go talk to Carl? Carl, okay. come with us. These ladies, they're, they're going to straighten all this out. They well, know. As, as you get closer, as you get closer, uh, you do see that hallie has got one hand holding the rope that's tied up Mosque, and then her and Antonine both have their arms around Pip. Oh, magic missile time. Boom. <laughs> all right. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Pip? Wait, 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 Pip? wait. What are you doing over there, buddy? You want to come over and hang out with us real quick? So Halia says, uh, well, first of all, the guy speaks up, okay? The guy's name is Duran. He, uh, he owns an orchard near Fandolin. Because I'm Duran. I own an orchard near Fandolin. Uh, I'm, part of the, I'm part of the group that was trying to get the Red Guards out of our town. You guys uh, 
kind of sort of helped do that. And we appreciate that. I am trying to shut down this Coke ring. And uh, Hallie here said she would help me. So she asked where the Coke was coming from. And I knew something about this well. So I led her here straight up to this well. <gasps> and then uh, he gets stabbed in the heart by Mosk, who's not really tied up. And he and Hallie were just faking the whole fucking thing because they're working together. So, mm. so they have Pip and they're telling you to back the fuck off. So Helia says, listen, we're taking over this coke, coke ring. You guys, fuck off. We have your kid. I'm sorry. What, uh, you, whoever has their hand on Pip, what's your name? Helia, the Hallia. barbarian lady. Okay. Helia, my name's Futt Buckerson. I want you to remember that. <laughs> okay. So uh, they, 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 they both have their knives out at, at Pip, right? And they, uh, they look at the cart. And they look over at you and they still, they're like, well, we, you know, so they get up and they're going to, they're going to take him away on the cart. Well, okay. So it's, are. it's, it, it's go time. All right, guys. I think we do this, right? I start charging up magic missiles and I look to the guys and I say, fellas, it's going to be a hot one. <laughs> <laughs>